My name is Aileen Hobbs and I teach Mandarin Chinese. I have always been fascinated about language and culture and my university degree was on English language and culture and Japanese and after graduating I taught English at a Chinese university for eight years before relocating to London and once I was here I heard about this course offered by SOAS to teach Mandarin as a foreign language so I enrolled and it was actually the first one um, ever and the rest is history. I have been working um, at SOAS Language Centre for about 15 years and Language Centre is very important because it plays the key role um, in promoting cultural understanding which is actually one of the core values of SOAS and it brings the world and different cultures closer together and what it offers students is a um, practical on hand um, language and culture experience before you know they venture out to the target language countries and and if they want to pursue further there will be opportunities to have in-depth studies My favourite things about SOAS is its heritage, prestige and internationalism. Um, it's like the world is being compacted and condensed in one place. Teaching and working in London means that you are part of this flamboyant metropolitan culture buzz and um, you hear different voices represented, you see all sorts of different colours and you certainly meet very interesting people in your language classes from all over the world and all walks of life. Three words to sum up Language Centre, that's not easy. Um, I'd say diverse, colourful and excellent. Well, with over 56% of its students coming from overseas and faculties with all sorts of different cultural heritages, SOAS is like the global village brought to you. So your way of thinking would constantly be challenged and stimulated because you will be inspired by others around you with very different cultural background and experiences. You will definitely leave this place with a much richer cultural insight, tolerance for others, and well-equipped to face the world. <laughs>